Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 137. Hey, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on my YouTube channel, then click on my college website link and download the Excel workbook, Magic Tricks 133 to 145. Hey, Trick 137, we want to look at Array Syntax. And I'm going to click in this cell right here and hit F2. Usually when you do VLOOKUP, you say, hey, look up this value here. And then for the here's VLOOKUP. It's a lookup value. But usually for the table array, you actually highlight the range. Now in other videos, I've showed you how to do this um, syntax. Commas are in co mean column and semicolon means rows. And so you can simulate it and then you don't have to waste space on uh, your a spreadsheet because then you have the lookup table right in your formula. Now the problem is is if you have a computer in a different country and you're, you have a different language for your computer then this doesn't work and so I want to show you how to uh, figure out how, what the syntax is. Do we use commas for columns? Do we use semicolons for a row or what? I'm going to click escape and you actually don't know how to don't have to know how to type this out. You can cheat if you have your data set in the sheet. Just say equals and then highlight the range and then hit the F9 key. F9 evaluates and that'll show you that comma is for column uh, and see that's number one and then it goes over another column so it's separated by a comma and then when it goes to a new row because now it's down to a new row you see semicolon. So let's change the language settings. We're going to go down to the start menu start menu and then I'm going to go to the control panel and then in the control panel if it'll behave here I'm going to have to go over to regional and language settings and I'm going to change this to Norway right there and it does a few things it uh, and you can customize it. Like if you click right here, it tells you what decimal symbol is. Oh, it's a comma. So decimals by a comma uh, and a bunch of other things. I'm going to click cancel here. Um, click OK. It's setting it. Now um, we're going to see the um, syntax for an array in just a moment. But, but watch this equals VL. You, another thing happens also. You can see that here's the screen tip for our arguments for VLOOKUP. Semicolons instead of commas for your functions. So the function arguments are separated by semicolons. Let's do our little trick here for syntax equals and go like that. Hit the F9 key. Sure enough, there's a backslash for column and semicolon for row. So the semicolon's the same, but not the column. So that's how you would uh, do it. Now I'm going to control C and click escape. Then I'm going to type uh, Norway here, control V, and a USA, and then uh, oh, look what it did too. When you open this up, it converted it, right? Because we changed the language. Uh, and you can see right there, USA is We'll get that in just a moment. Now I'm going to go back and change my settings. Start control panel, and then regional uh, regional language options, and I'm going to change it back to English USA something right here, and then click OK. Uh oh, it's still got that. But if I close this, if I control uh, S, and uh, this is in 2000 and seven it's saying what things are incompatible with earlier versions if I save it and open it up it may actually take me a have to close I may have to close everything if I save it and open it up even close Excel right here it should come up um, and show us that we have and there it is, it's back to normal. So now we can scoop this out here, control C, and then paste it right there. All right, we'll see you next trick.